All right. So we have Miss Delivery. Uh, you've got basically one of tier one gear. You got one of each. And it's in high school. So good luck, everybody. <laughs> It's going to be, um, it's going to be, a, it's, this is going to be a bumpy ride. Not going to lie. But let's go, let's jump in here. Yeah, this is, I, I remember this, I remember this challenge from other times we've done this challenge. This challenge, because it also seems like they screwed around with how much the ghost actually... Uh, interacts because if I remember right this ghost does not do much <laughs> but yeah this is every other time we every other time we've done this map so far or th done this challenge it's sometimes taken three times walking around high school just to find the freaking ghost. Oh, why is it why is it more rough uh, multiplayer? Oh, because of gear. Yeah, you're not going to have oh yeah. Didn't think about that. All right, I'm probably going to be a little bit more quiet than I usually am. Like I know I normally talk while we're doing all this, but. Uh, Thomas Williams. Give me a sign, buddy. Thomas. Yep. Yeah, I normally am not patient and I just keep talking and just walking. This one, because I've done this a few times now, yeah, this one is, no, you walk, you listen, you walk, you listen. <laughs> oh, sorry guys. There you go. Ooh. Okay, that will be helpful. I can't remember if the voodoo doll... Okay, now cursed object is question mark, so that's going to change. But that's not a bad, that's not a bad cursed item to get. Thomas Miller, make a sound. Savant, hello, how you doing today? Waiting for the kids to get out of the bathroom so I can run them to school. Then I'll be free all day. Nice. They missed the bus. All 
But I'm trying to think of ways to do this better. Uh, one thing you could do is run around and shut all the doors. Make sure all the doors are shut. And then walk around again and see if any of the doors get touched. Thomas Miller, hello. Mm. Yeah. Ghost, are you here? Thomas Miller. Oh, found the bone. <laughs> Wasn't expecting that. One hundred percent. I don't know if you got sandy pills or not, but if you do, they're tier one. They're tier one sandy pills. Let me look. Um. Yeah, you got tier one sandy. You got one tier one sandy pill. Yeah, I yeah, this challenge it's like they specifically made the ghost quiet. Like they made they changed the setting in the game where the ghost acts like a shade, though it won't be a shade. Oh yeah, you start off with 100%. I think... Oh, wait, wait, wait. Oh, thank you, ghost. Love you. Thank you, ghost. Love you again. All right. So, there we go. We got fingies. Sir talks quite a lot. Hello. Welcome on in. too easy. Oh, that's a good start. All right, get your guesses in, everybody. I'm going to turn it off here uh, by the time I get back to the high school. By the time I get back inside, I'm going to turn off guessing. So change your guesses if you want to. Change your guesses if you want to. Your first evidence is ultraviolet. Right, so yeah, we only lost eighty percent. We only lost twenty percent sanity. <laughs> well, I mean, your guess is always going to be one hundred percent random. You have nothing. You have nothing to go off of. Now you do. But I'm feeling generous today because of uh, this. This challenge is going to be a pain in the ass. And I got my 75 uh, average achievement, so I'm feeling generous today. Did it shut the... Wait, where's the ghost at? There we go. Okay. All right. Actually, let's throw you on there. That's not where I wanted to throw you at. There we go. Are you here? Where are you? How old are you? You're not hearing me. Where are you? How old are you? There we go. Are you a ghost? Are you friendly? Are you insane? Are you my friend? Are you a taco? Uh, not zero yet. Oh yeah. See, this is why I have to end when I when I say end, or when I put in my first evidence. If I don't, I forget about it. Nope, you get nothing. As Willy Wonka would say, "You get nothing, sir." Oh, 
I mean, I at least, you know, let you guys keep guessing until I get my first evidence. A lot of other people who have this game, you guess before they go in and then they turn it off. <laughs> I'm at least nice. <laughs> no, that's not true. I've had plenty of demons not... Hell, I've had plenty of demons not hunt me until 25% sanity. Just because it's a demon does not mean it has to hunt you early. Um... Yeah, still not zero. Are you here? Or are you? There we go. Thank you. All right, so we got spirit box. All right, mimic phantom or poltergeist. Well, okay, that actually makes things much much easier. Are you not entertained? Yeah, it is, Astro. Are you not entertained? Thank you, Grim Reaper. All right, so that made so that makes that that makes this much easier. At least the first hunt much much easier. Yeah, it's three evidence, but it's three evidence with tier one. So take that for what it's worth. But I mean, I could go use a voodoo doll right now, force a hunt, and figure out what this ghost is after I go in here with uh, the video camera. I don't think I think if it's ghost yeah another ghost could be ghost orb so yeah we got the voodoo doll well I mean not all the challenges are going to be easy some of the challenges are going to be a pain in the butt. This is one of them. And I still kind of think the best course of action on this one is just go around, shut all the doors, and then and then do your... And then start walking around. I mean, I got lucky on this one, but that's because I'm also being very patient on this one. What evidence am I actually looking for? So not EMF, so ghostwriting... Freezing temps, dots, ghost orb we know is not there, so. All right, don't see an orb, so not a mimic. Um, do we got writing? Uh, kicked my book. So, <laughs> kicked the book, so it ain't writing. Yep, there's the book. So, not writing. So, pull these out. So, Phantom or Mi and Mimic's out. So, um, uh, yeah, Phantom. Saul, how you doing? Mm. All right, so we got that one. One down, two to go. Well, at least I hope it's one down. It kicked the book, so it can't be Pulte. We didn't see a ghost orb, so it shouldn't be Mimic. Very busy weekend for the most part. Pretty good. Gonna pick up some editing side jobs and gonna leave Walmart. 
So that is pretty good. But yeah, wife and I are talking about it. And she, she's been wanting to do this teacher pay teacher thing for like a few years. But she she doesn't want to edit. She doesn't... Uh, or she doesn't have time to edit, really. And she doesn't really know how to edit. But I've been doing editing now for four years. So basically, I'm going to work for her for a little bit. I'm going to work for her. Then I'm going to start, I'm going to start going out to Fiverr and uh, start trying to pick up some side editing jobs. Plus other stuff that I got going on. That it's like, okay, no, me quitting... Me quitting Walmart now is feasible. And I can go back to doing this full time, which means after I give up my two weeks, this is going to go back to six hours. Nah, two weeks. I mean, I, do I plan on going back? No. But I'll still give him two weeks. I mean, one, one of my friends works for them, and I like my boss. So, all right. Why am I looking at that? I have no clue. And then if it doesn't work out, I go back working for... I go uh, I go work go work for Melon again. No, not yet. I'm going to give them my notice today. There's an off chance that they could keep me, but I doubt that they will do it. And that's is uh, give me the exemption and let me work Monday through Thursday and let me sit when I'm not uh, carrying stuff out. Eh, Walmart's actually not too bad. I mean, to be totally honest, Walmart's not that bad. At least the wall. Now, granted, that all depends on who's your boss. <laughs> my boss actually is my boss is actually pretty good. He sometimes doesn't know how to do a schedule, but for the most part, Actually, I think the last time the schedule that I ran into a problem with yesterday, which was half the guys didn't even have their lunches correct or their breaks correct, so I had to go through and correct everything. Um, I think I think our overall boss did that schedule, <laughs> but uh, but for the most part, he tries to he tries to work with you, all that kind of good stuff. But if they want to let me work Monday through Thursday and let me sit, uh, there's a chance that I'll I'll stay. Because right now the big th the big thing right now is because they're making me stand now where I used to be able to sit my my diabetes and neuropathy in my feet are beginning to uh, get a little painful at work so but I doubt they'll do that so. But I know he's. I'll, I'm going to go in a little earlier today just so I can talk, so I can let him know. And if they go, is there anything we can do to keep you? I'll, I'll go, you can do this. If you can't do this, then no, I'm gone. Uh, dispersing. So I was one of the, you know, you order online, you come pick up your stuff, or you come to pick your pick up your stuff, and I bring it out to your car. No, Walmart's Walmart actually has a rule that you have to work at least one day weekend. So yeah, but there is a store manager exemption if they so choose to use it. But I wouldn't <laughs> because as soon as you give one person an exemption, everyone else is going to want an exemption. So. Oh, darn it. Sorry. Uh, we had a phantom, right? What's our cursed item? Well, I don't think we got a good... Ah, we got music box. Kind of a crappy... Uh, that's not a good... That's not a good... Uh, cursed item for this challenge yeah but 
I mean, personally, I just want I I I want to leave. Like like my three days off, my feet had been perfectly fine. Last night, by the end of by the end of work last night, my toes were tingling. And I'm like, yeah, it's the standing part that's uh that's driving me nuts. I mean, it's great to get the 25% sanity. You just turn it on and hold it. And your sanity drops like a rock. Uh. I'm trying to think if that's supposed to be there. Yeah, on, on the bright side, though, for this map, at least if you're solo, your sanity drops so slow that you get plenty of time to look for the ghost. Unless it's a demon, they or yokai. Uh, I thought I heard a door. Kelly Elliott. Where are you? Scooby Dooby Doo. I'm pretty excited about I'm pretty excited about getting her um getting her teacher teachers pay teacher uh thing going too. Because she's been like like she's been like she basically films like a top down of her hands doing all these art projects for uh, for class so she's had them she's got like i don't know how many freaking videos but she just doesn't do the editing to put them out there she's been talking about this for like three four like three four years now so now i can do it and i can do the editing for her and do all the graphic graphic design stuff for her and we can get this thing rolling for ah worked at walmart as an overnight stalker back in 08 got hurt on their schedule lifting brake pack packer loaded it too heavy so when i went to tip it in my cart yeah i mean i'm not saying it and also i mean that's individual walmart stuff I mean, right now we've got a person out on medical leave, mental, and she's not coming back till December. I thought I heard footsteps. All right, all the doors are shut. All right, be patient, walk around, listen. But now that's that's definitely definite BS on their part. All right. There's another way I could possibly do this. I don't know how well it'll work, though. But you could take a parabolic and go into a class, like go midway in a classroom, and then just aim down the hallways. It 
and maybe pick up a parabolic. I don't know how well that will work, though. Mm. That sounds like military. I've got, I've got, I've got a few friends whose backs are screwed up because of military, and they had to fight tooth and nail for disability. It's like you're kicking me out of the military because my back got screwed up by doing this, and now you're going to fight me over the disability? Really? So you're the ones who kicked me out. What the hell? Armchair, how you doing today? Well, okay, I I am pretty sure I shut all the doors. There we go. All right, we found the ghost. Aaliyah, thank you for the lovely 24 months of support. Much, much, much appreciated. How are you doing today? Entered a backwood resident working as PSW fairly considerable about two weeks before we moved in together. Took nearly a year. To yep. Just tuckered. Well, I hope you get some rest so you're not tuckered. All right. Um, doot, 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 doot. 72, so we're still sitting pretty good there. The ghost is at the entrance, so we can actually bring in more gear. But we have no evidence yet. Get your guesses in. I'll be turning it off as soon as, uh, as soon as I get some, uh, as soon as I get one evidence, I'll be turning it off. Thank you, ghost. Love you. All right. Nothing there. Nothing there. This is one nice thing about, about, um, Three evidence, though, is you can mark stuff off. Oh, not a mare. All right. Are you here? All right, so there's Spirit Box. Uh, there's my book. So, just in case it kicks it. Oh, we got tips already. Nice. So, Maroy, Onrio, or Twins. Good. And that. So we got Spirit Box. We got Temps. We do not have Ultraviolet. So, Onrio, Twins. Uh, actually, just in case. Okay. So we don't have Ultraviolet. Onrio, Twins, or Maroy. Sorry, Hamchi. I, bought, I beat you. <laughs> I just, I just, I just ended it. Yeah, Mimic's out because we don't have... I mean, okay. Technically, Mimic could be in. If it touches the door again, I'll... Maybe I should have left it until... Okay. I'll make adjustments to the guessing. I will stop. I won't turn it off until we verify that it is not a Mimic. <laughs> because technically... It could have been pretending to be an Obaki and touched the door and erased its fingerprint before I could look. So from now on with the guessing, I will not... As soon as Mimic is not an option, like it's EMF, Dots, Book, like if that's our first evidence... Oh, we got a ghost. Oh, shit. We got a ghost orb. Oh, Onrio. Uh, all right, so we need to... Don't need that. I need the ghost to touch something again. Because, yeah, it could have been pretending to be a mimic. What's his name? Thomas Miller? No, Kelly Elliott. That was the last ghost. Kelly Elliott, touch a door. Touch a window. Touch something other than me. Don't touch me. Leave me alone. Where are you? I had to clarify. Ghost might have got confused. 
I mean, if I die, I die. I've got Henri ch chosen, so. Elliot. Elliot. Go home. Uh, where's that? Yeah, let's turn that thing off, shall we? Come on, Elliot, touch a door. I mean, we could go get a candle. Eh, let's go get a candle. And I... Okay, yeah, we can do this. I wanted to grab a smudge stick, but I've got... That, that, uh, I could do that. I can still grab a smudge. I can drop my... I can drop the flashlight. Grab that, grab that, grab that. Let's see if we can piss off uh, Onryo. I might... We're coming up on a break. I might take... After this map, I might take a break. And then we'll come back for the third. That's the other thing with this with this challenge. This challenge takes so freaking long. Hi. Get the crap out of me. Thank you. <sighs> okay. Come on. Blow some candles. Or touch a door. Either either one will work. Yeah. I mean, technically, we know what it is. I'm just making sure it's not a mimic so I don't have to do this again. Blow out the candle. All right, that was a window touch. I don't see anything. All right, we're going on, Rio. Make sure we got it in the book. Kazaz, hello. Welcome on in. A few days ago, I played Phasma, was in Edgefield singing, Do You Want to Touch Me? <laughs> yes, it did. Either that or the ghost wasn't a culture club fan. One or the other. Oh no, you were you weren't you weren't saying do you want to hurt me? You said do you want to touch me? Okay. So maybe it was a culture club fan. Alright, let's see. What do we got? There we go. There's two. Um, you know what? Let's go ahead and start this. I can always step out and then go on break. If we get lucky. Maybe we find if we get lucky, it hunts me early and it's slow or it's fast, and we know it's a demon or a thay. At least on this challenge, I've not had it's not been easy. You know what? I don't think this works. I want to say they broke the thermometer specifically. Yeah, I think they broke the thermometer, if I remember right, on this challenge. I want to say this is when they kind of broke the thermometer where you couldn't walk. Because you used to be able to walk around high school, and the thermometer would go down in the hallways. So you were able to easily find where the ghost was. When they, went to, when they came up with the Tier 1, Tier 2, Tier 3 stuff... Yeah, you could just walk around with your th with the tier one thermometer, and it would just, and the thermometer would go down in the hallways. So you knew like the ghost was somewhere in this hallway. Yep, he's like, Daddy, it's about break time. Why are you Why are you still here? Why are you not giving me treats? He's very demanding. But I don't think this works anymore. But at least, actually, this will work out. Oh, you know, let's do this. Walk around. Shut all the doors. Go on break. Come back. And then go around and see if we find a door open.
this might be actually the easiest way to do this challenge. <laughs> Uh, thermometer's going down. And it's continuously going down. Wait, why is that not... Uh, hmm... Desk kitty cam is not working. Or did I forget to turn it? Sorry, guys. Uh, last ghost was Onrio. Sorry, brain is brain is not working apparently. Oh, the rubber's going back up. Interesting. Challenge this week is, uh, what's the name of it? Missed delivery. Basically, you have one of each tier one gear. And you're in high school. But you get three evidence. You get 100% um, sanity. It's just, I seriously think they tweaked this challenge. So you don't hear the ghost or the, where the ghost is very quiet. Cause every time I've done this challenge now, you rarely freaking hear the ghost. Okay. We got the voodoo doll again. That's good. That'll make it a little bit easier to find uh, find the ghost. Now, the question is, is why is my sanity dropping like a... I mean, why is my thermometer dropping like a rock when I come in the... When I'm coming in here? Oh, let's stay here for a second. My ghost might be a... Uh... Oh, this isn't good. <laughs> this isn't good at all. <laughs> Shit. No, don't be in here. I got freaking tier one gear and I've only got one of them. Ah, uh, crap. I think my ghost is in here, everybody. Yeah, this isn't going to be helpful. Okay, now it's going back up. So now it's 7-8. Okay, uh, it might not be here. I mean, we got breath though, so it's probably here. Oh, wait, I think. Just touch that door. Yep, touch this door. All right, we found the ghost. Yeah. I don't want it here. I don't want it to be here. Uh, this sucks. No, it's not. Okay, uh, hopefully, hopefully, we get we'll get you know it'll be like the ghost will like give itself away during the hunt. All right, I don't see an orb. That would have been helpful. All right, I got about three minutes till the break. I'm going to go in, try this stuff, and I'll walk out. Then I'll come out and we'll go on break. Are you here? Where are you? How old are you? You're not working. Are you here? Where are you? Taken away. Okay, thank you. We'll just go right there. How's this looking? Not zero yet, but we'll go here.
All right, so we got spirit box. I'm just going to leave guessing on for right now. Well, I mean, most likely it's not going to be on that back wall. Oh, here, before I, before we, before we leave. I mean, before we go on break, there we go. <laughs> you have a Cyrus boy. I mean, really, this one's going to be more about, um, this is going to be more about erasing evidence. I want to put the snooze. I want it. Wait, I thought I turned, did I, no, I, no, I, did I, did I just turn off guessing? Oh, Saul turned off guessing. Bad Saul. This is why, yeah. All right, let me put in, I'm putting in spirit. Starting it up again. There, put your guesses in. Right, we've already got a good angle there, so I'm just going to put this out here and aim it this way. Hi. All right, let's get out of here. And then we'll go on break and we'll come back and we'll see if we can figure out this ghost. Get your guesses then. You do have a spirit box, right? Yeah. I don't know why I hit two, but we did. All right, so you got spare box. Let's go on break. I'll be right back and then we will finish this up. All right, we'll go back, everybody. We had a kitty in a kit cat tree. All right. But who won the drop? All right, so we got all that in. Don't see anything there. Don't see anything on the back wall either. Oh, this is a better cam, that. All right, so let's go this. Um, we got spirit box, right? Yeah. So we'll, we'll take in some salt. We'll take in this. So Saul one. Okay, dope. All right. Let's see what we got. I'll pick up the flashlight once I get this stuff in because don't have anything else to do. Walk around with the. Uh, Walk around with the dots. Still not freezing. Are you here? Where are you? How old are you? Are you a ghost? Where are you? Are you here? Are you friendly? Are you sad? This is going to be a pain in the butt. Where are you? Are you here? Are you there? Are you sad? Are you mad? Would you answer me, please? I know you're here. Where are you? Are you friendly? All right. Um, let's do. All right, let's try this. So let's put this here. We'll grab that. Where's my... Oh, flashlight's outside, isn't it? Darn it. Um, a couple of ways we can do this. We don't see orbs, so let's take off orb. Um, I could force a hunt, make it walk through the salt, and then look for fing uh, fingerprints. Or look for uh, footsteps. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, it's not that I haven't thought about it, but. If 
But I might be able to figure out what the ghost is from the hunt alone, if I'm lucky. I saw a basketball get thrown. But the rest of the basketballs are kind of still here. Are you here? Where are you? Are you a ghost? I know you threw a bas one of these basketballs. Are you here? How old are you? Are you a ghost? Would you like to answer us? Where are you, you piece of junk? Oh, you're a pain in the butt. Yes, you are a ghost. Where are you? Are you here? Are you there? Are you friendly? Event. Ah, I was trying to get to walk over here. Oh, but wait, wait, wait. Nah, nothing. All right. Let's get this over with. All right. So how we're going to do this is aim this this way. So, okay. That's crap. Oh, come on. Really? Yeah, that stupid door jam is stopping the light. Oh, you, I hate you. All right. So we're going to do it this way. Drop you. I mean, it walked right over that, it walked right over that, that, yeah, it walked right over that salt, right? So if it walked right over that salt, it's got a kind of, yeah, no, we're going Wraith. You've got to, like, got, get to the, uh, get outside the truck. I mean, uh, get back to the base. Change the rates and I'm going to end. But I mean, it stepped right over that salt and it didn't do anything. So I'm going, going that. And if it's not a wraith, then darn it game. You walked right over my salt. Ha! Welcome back. There's shops ready for you. Nope. You're wrong. All right, we're done. Yay. So it was Wraith. So there we go. Uh, took us uh, probably about an hour to do that challenge. Now, footsteps were normal. Anyway, couldn't have been twins. All right. Uh, la, 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 la. So there we go. Reset and Oh yeah, let's leave so we get my gear back. <laughs>